Welcome back everyone, Twitch is here, and I am back yet again for just a quick video. We're going to take a look at a brand new Beetlejuice animated, it's a vinyl figure of the character of Lydia Dietz. A character that really has never had an action figure outside of Burger King. There was supposed to be one for the loyal subjects, but unfortunately it never came to fruition. Now, we have this Culture Fly vinyl figure. Comes in this cool Beetlejuice animated box. It's a nice window box. You get to see artwork from the original animated series, Culture Fly, right there. There's not much to it. However, I took a gamble. I looked at the dimensions, the sizes... And I'm actually pretty stoked to say if you are looking for a Lydia Dietz action figure slash vinyl figure from the animated series, look no further. They did a fantastic job with this. Even though there's no moving parts and pieces, I just wanted it for my shelf. They even got the spider webs of the tablecloth that makes up her dress, the head portrait. While a little bit large, it fits the animated style. They even have the fingerless gloves slash bodysuit that she wears. Everything is painted really nicely. So and that alone, uh, I'm just overall very stoked. Even down to the head portrait, you can see the eyes, the purple, the little bit of the peach kind of color that goes above her eyelid. It's all done well. And the very angular nature, especially up top with her hair tie with the various colors there and then her kind of tentacle-like hair. They nailed it. Now, there is a stand attached to her. Of course, you can clearly see. The top says Beetlejuice. It's really not printed well at all. But thankfully, she does come as two separate pieces. So that's a nice aspect of this. So you can remove it if you'd like. And another great aspect is that she stands by herself without the big black stand. But just to kind of show you, and we'll get the box out of the way here, she does have little teeny tiny pegs on the bottom of her feet. It kind of gives her just a little bit more height than you would probably want in comparison to a Beetlejuice figure. And lo and behold, this goes really nicely with the Loyal Subjects Beetlejuice figure, as you can clearly see. You kind of have a hard time standing Beetlejuice more than anything, but while that figure wasn't exactly, we'll say, action figure perfection, too many weird cuts, the paint wasn't great, very loose joints, it was kind of a mess in kind of just standing, looking, just on your shelf, not touching it, not doing anything with it. Sure, as far as right now goes, because of very little representation, this Beetlejuice is fine. And we even have Ginger the Spider, which was a pack-in for the Loyal Subjects Beetlejuice. Seeing all three of these together just makes me want more. Now, I am one of those people where it is going to sit on my shelf. I don't need it to be overly articulated, and that's where this Lydia really shines. It's just the representation of these characters on my shelf for an animated series that I absolutely love. So for that alone, yes, I definitely recommend picking one up. Now, where can you get this? Well, they haven't hit mine just yet, but you can find Lydia and a Beetlejuice in the same Culture Fly sort of style at five and below. So you can head out to your store. They're also online. I'm sure you can get it off eBay, Mercari, something like that. But yes, highly recommend if you're a Beetlejuice animated fan, Lydia looks great and she looks good with this Beetlejuice so I'm very happy to say and even just capturing the angle designs. Loyal Subjects did a great job in bringing the characters to life in that sense but the execution of the action figures just didn't work out in their favor. And hopefully with the success of Beetlejuice Beetlejuice they'll go oh you know what let's do more stuff with the animated series and then you'll see other companies kind of picking up that license and really going to town with it because there's some great character designs, characters that really need toys, toy representations. So again, thank you very much for watching. I hope you grab a Lydia if you want it, and I'll be back later today with some more action figure deets. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.